Texas Rangers are on the hunt for a new manager and president. And we begin this afternoon with that massive shakeup underway now in Arlington. Thanks for joining us. I'm Chris Lawrence. The Rangers fire team president John Daniels two days after parting ways with manager Chris Woodward. Mike Leslie is live at Globe Life Field. Mike, uh, the ball club is definitely cleaning house. Yeah, Chris, I mean, at this point, uh, General Manager Chris Young is basically all that's left atop the Rangers' decision-making pyramid, baseball decision-making pyramid. Longtime GM and president of baseball operations John Daniels is out just two days after manager Chris Woodward was fired as well. The timing of all this is the most puzzling part. Based upon on-field success, none of what has happened this week is all that much of a surprise. Honestly, today's move makes Monday's firing of Woodward more powerful because now he's not just the sacrificial fall guy. Now it's clear they are cleaning house. But the timing remains odd. Why not just fire both Woodward and Daniels on the same day? Owner Ray Davis says he didn't want the two moves to be linked together. There's about zero chance that that will happen. But it is true the Rangers are bad and they needed to do something. The bottom line is we're not good. And we haven't been good for six years.